Welcome back, everyone. Our friends down in Canyon are kicking off the Christmas this Christmas holiday this weekend. Stephanie Price and our good friend Roger Remlinger from the uh, Canyon area. You guys are down here. We're always checking out the fun things that you guys are doing, but the focus really on this weekend. It's a good opportunity for you to head down to Canyon. So, Stephanie. Tell us about what you guys are doing on Friday. So at the Panhandle Plains Historical Museum, we have our Christmas open house. It's Friday night from 6 to 9 and Saturday from 1 to 5. And we'll have Santa and Mrs. Claus. Mm -hmm. Mrs. Claus doesn't show up a lot, so it's a chance to meet Mrs. Claus. And she's okay. very important to this whole thing. I don't know if you guys have figured this yeah, out. She's, she's the boss, as let's, we all Let's know. be honest here. <laughs> and we are doing the entire event with... Um, as a donation to the High Plains Food Bank. So if you bring a dollar or a canned item, um, that is your admission into the door. So it's our way of giving back to the people who give to us all year. And you also have some neat, fun things for the kids to do as well. Christmas crafts. Um, we've got some fun stuff out here on um, the table as we're showing off. And we've got, you can make a snowflake or a holiday card or a, if you want to model the Rudolph Finger oh. Puppet, you're welcome to do that, Andy. Oh, very nice. Yes. I see so. what I... My Bring finger, the girls. My fingers, unfortunately, are too big. <laughs> um, that's a shame. Uh, one more thing that we want to talk about is I, I love the stories, that, the stories that get told throughout the museum. Absolutely. We have storytellers yeah. that go on in Lano Theater, and they come and volunteer every year. And then, of course, cookie decorating and our choirs from all over the area. We couldn't do it without our choirs. They're from yeah. all, all elementary schools in Amarillo and Canyon, all the way up to high schools, and, of course, West Texas A&M University it Show Choir. Definitely gets you in the spirit of Christmas. Okay, Roger, so then we turn our focus to all things Canyon on Saturday, really profiling everything that's happening down there, and it's all good. Right, so after the this at the open house at the museum, you're going to want to come down to the square for our Christmas in Canyon event. We'll start around 4 o'clock. We'll have Santa Claus and ornament decorating, cookie decorating, letters of Santa, all the local choirs as well. And then at 6.30, we'll start our annual light parade. One great thing that we have down in the square this year is our brand new Christmas tree. It actually yeah. does a 35-minute show uh, with really? music, so that'll be really neat, as well as the Texas strain is always amazing when it's lit up. So yeah. it's a great day all around for Canyon with the museum and then also the stuff that we've got going down in the square, pancake dinner going on at the Cole Community Center. So uh, it's, a great, it's a great day to spend in Canyon. I think that I get amazed every time that I go down, and Stephanie went to school at WT oh. as well, the, uh, the amount of changes that you see happening in Canyon, every time you go down there, there's a new business, there's something fresh, there's something happening, and you guys have gotten such a buzz. What's the secret? What, what, is, what is happening down there in Canyon? Well, it's the people that live there and the people that work there mm -hmm. and, and the new ideas that have been brought up over the last uh, few years. So, uh, you know, if you're, if you're coming there for tourism, obviously the museum and the Canyon are a big yeah. draw. If you're coming there to shop, you're coming down the square or any other store that we have in Canyon, if you're coming to eat, uh, there's a lot of new options, so uh, it's growing and it's going good, yeah. and, and we're excited to about this weekend, and we can Perfect. do things like this. All right, if you want more information, go check out the Chamber of Commerce, and we'll put all that information over on our website. Make sure you get uh, get done to Canyon this weekend. Coming up next, it's time for live.